One thing nice about today's industry is there's a lot of different options for lead straps. It used to just be one or two, but now we have all these different options. And it's nice because there's different sensitivity levels in these cattle. And I'd compare it to like a different bit on a horse. You know, some are harder mouth, some are lighter. You know, and the cattle are the same way about their uh, bridge of their nose and their chin. Uh, and that's where we're gonna differ in the differences of these. Uh, but just to kind of get us started here, a uh, couple different things in the strap. Uh, they come with the leather uh, lead strap. Uh, or the Brahma lead. Uh, one thing nice about the Brahma is it's almost, it already has a broken feel to it. It's actually rubber um, instead of leather. Um, where the leather one will feel like that eventually, but you just kind of got to get them broke in first. Now that being said, when you kind of get your normal show halter, uh, it's going to come with just a regular chain, all right? And that's usually where we're going to start. Um, and when it comes to these, we're going to try them on them at home first and see kind of what strength we're going to need, uh, you know, what they like, uh, you know, because we're just kind of trying to match this with the calf, all right? Uh, and that's where we're gonna start with the chain. Um, and you know, a lot of times that's gonna be our go-to. You know, one thing uh, that's a really neat option is the sure hand lead. And these come with a regular chain or the spike chain. Uh, but this is designed to help younger exhibitors out. Uh, it gives them extra leverage and getting the head up uh, as well as it can get their head higher. Uh, and one thing nice too is it kind of trains them kids to hold on to the lead closer to the halter. Uh, a lot of times we're not going to be hanging on back here. We're going to use the strap for leading, but when we're setting them up, we're going to be holding on to the chain or in the sure hands case on the handle here uh, or like here so on the chain. Um, so that's really nice, kind of gets kids used to hanging on here, uh, but it gives them extra leverage uh, and one really neat option for the younger exhibitors. Uh, you know, going from there, if the chain's too much for a calf, uh, they offer it in a wrap, uh, you know, and you could wrap them too, uh, but uh, this wrapped one's really nice because uh, some cattle are just too sensitive uh, for the chain. Um, so that's kind of a nice option if you do have an ultra sensitive calf. Uh, now going the other direction, there's some different options. One of the new ones, the rawhide, um, this offers just a little more bite and control, uh, but not quite as heavy duty as the uh, spikes. Uh, kind of a neat option if you're kind of looking for something in between. This one might be one you want to try. Uh, and then we got the spikes, all right? Um, you know, and these can be beneficial in the calves that are a little harder headed, uh, maybe, uh, you know, a little more spirited. But a lot of times we use them the most on the ones that are really gentle and kind of dead headed and we need some more leverage to get their head up. Uh, or if we just need more control leading around the ring. Uh, a lot of times these are good for calves uh, with little kids just because they uh, you know, maybe don't respect them enough. So we're going to go with the spike. Um, but these are really good, you know, if you want to get them to just get their attention a little bit more. Uh, one thing that is important to remember, not all states allow the spike at state shows. Um, so you just want to check your rule books. Most do, but there are a few that don't. So you just want to check that out before you get there. Um, that's a really beneficial tool if you need it. There's lots of different options uh, and there's lots of different scenarios, different exhibitors, different cattle, different sensitivity levels. Uh, main thing I'd say is you just want to try them on them at home. Uh, different cattle like different leads. <laughs>